Ooh. We're finally done installing all the right stuff on this space station. It's just a success! I really hope we have a quiet day today and without incident. JJ, hey! I'm finally awake and ready to work! We have too many things to finish! Mikey, be careful! You don't need to destroy anything here and don't touch it, because you don't know how to contain your power. Don't lecture me, please. I'm a great scientist who studies the moon. I'm the backbone of this whole station. Mikey, you're making a lot of mistakes that you shouldn't be making. Be careful today because today is an incredibly important day for the entire research process. The whole problem is that I don't care about it. I will literally ruin literally everything here if I want to. Because I'm not really interested. Mikey, please don't make that mistake. Because your behavior could really mess us up. We have to explore every day. I think you want too much, JJ. Your attempts may be very interesting, but you won't accomplish much. So, be careful. I'm going to continue my business and destroy everything here. I'll even blow up the whole village. It's going to be very, very fun. Oh no, friends. Mikey has really gotten incredibly evil and he wants to destroy everything here. Both our lab and the village. I just don't have any other choice and I have to do something. I have to stop Mikey before he destroys all the equipment and hurts all the villagers. Ha ha ha. That would be a really huge destruction. No one will ever be able to stop me. Because I'm just unbelievably cool. So, I'll be able to do literally anything I want. No one can stop me. Not even JJ. He just doesn't have the power. Mikey, get over here as fast as you can. I'll build you a platform and a rocket to fly you off this moon once and for all. No one will help you. So, you're going to Earth. Most likely you can find a new home there and solve something. Oh no, that sounds just unbelievably awful. But I guess that's the only choice I can make. Friends. But before we go any further, don't forget to subscribe and like us. Your support is very important to us. The more likes you give, the more cool videos we'll have. And of course, your activity will help me stay on this planet. Yeah, Mikey, get over here as fast as you can. You need to get on and go right away. There is no other option. You have violated all the laws of our moon. Okay, if that's what you really want, then I'll go to Earth. I'll explore it without you and do whatever I want. It's the right thing to do. I'll finally be on my own, and it would be a shame to miss this chance. It means I can become the coolest scientist in the world. Good luck to you, Mikey. I really hope you find someone to help you there, because I'm never gonna need you here at all. Who, folks, Mikey's finally gone. That means I can do my research in a more normal environment. No one's gonna bother me now. That's just great news. I feel bad for Mikey, but our work is more important. I really hope he can't get into any trouble on Earth. But if there are any, he'll deal with them. It's Mikey. I, on the other hand, am going to rebuild everything he's destroyed. It needs to be done as quickly as possible, so the villagers don't get angry. Then, I'll go explore the moon further. What's going to happen to Mikey is a good question, because it's been a long time since we've been to Earth, and we don't know what's going on there. It'll be a good test for him to pass, because if he doesn't, he'll just be incredibly weak. So we're going to move on. I really hope he's going to be okay and not get into trouble. We'll have to fly to him later and check on him and see how he's doing. For now, I have a completely different assignment. I have to get back to my research as soon as possible. It could really be very, very important. Whoa, folks! I've finally fallen down and landed! It's just something incredible! This is my new life on Earth! JJ chased me away. But that just means I can be on my own. I mean, that's just incredibly cool. I've always dreamed of something like this, especially since all this work won't interfere with my talent anymore. I'll be able to do whatever I want and not depend on anyone. Hey, aren't you one of those people who was on the moon just now? That's just incredibly cool. I'm one of the scientists of this village. I saw your rocket trying to land on Earth. I'm a big expert and of course a scientist. I've always wanted to meet you, Mikey. Yeah, you even know me? Where are you from anyway? Do I know you? It's very simple. I've been following you for a long time and recording all the information. You're Mikey and your friend is JJ. Follow me as fast as you can and I'll show you everything I've got. Where are you even taking me? Do you have some kind of plan and want to do something to me? I don't understand it at all. I want to take you to my laboratory. We have a science center here that helped us gather information about you. So you're a good scientist too. 
You have a really big station here. I'd be interested in seeing everything. Of course I'll help you go through it and see what's there. It's not a big problem, Mikey. This is where the loudest and coolest discoveries are made for the whole world. We're the ones who invented the telescope. So you don't have all the technology yet? I guess we're in a different time, because I've had one at home for a long time. Really? You people are amazing, Mikey. I wanted to invite you to take a look around and draw your own conclusions. All I can say is that it all looks very ambitious. I like the way you've built the place. But what exactly are you doing? We are studying a lot of things here. But our job right now is to test the moon people in our trials. So now that I'm here, I have to take some tests? Don't you think it could be very dangerous for me? What about JJ? I don't see JJ anywhere near you. And these tests are just to test your intelligence and of course your strength. We have a theory that you are much stronger than anyone we've ever seen. So it would be interesting to know the difference between us. It's true that JJ and I are quite different from everyone else. We're much faster, much stronger and smarter than many monsters. That's why no one has ever been able to defeat us. We were just so much better than everyone else. That's just incredibly useful information. I can say that I believe you, Mikey. You seem just unbelievable. Thank you so much. JJ sent me from the moon right here. I have no food, no home. I don't know what to do at all. I can just work in the field and get my diamonds. Or are there any other programs? Of course there are. If you work with us, we can reach incredible heights. We can discover many useful things. You just have to pass a few tests before we can hire you. You will be one of our scientists. Wow, that sounds really, really cool. I'm 100% willing to take then all the tests you give me. Your first test, it will be quite simple, but also at the same time dangerous parkour. There's lava down here. Don't fall down. Parkour is JJ's thing. He loves it. But I'd rather do a maze or something like that. That would be more fun. That's right. You could build a maze. I'd completely forgotten about it. Okay, I'll add it to the next challenge. Going through this parkour is much easier than the ones when we're on adventures. There's really a difference in difficulty between the two. Those were much more dangerous, sharper. These ones look like I'm a kid trying to get through them. Is there going to be something harder? Of course there will be. You'll have another test of your intuition and of course a battle with monsters. I have to evaluate all of your talents. If you can pass all this, you can become a real scientist. I can promise you that. I really hope so, because everything is so complicated in the new world. I thought I could pass everything and live peacefully. But you'll need to work hard here too. The whole problem is that you're too cautious, Mikey. You need to get a lot rougher and only think about yourself. Yeah, I know. I can overcome a lot more in a fit of anger. But I don't need that right now. I can pass all your tests without even falling. If you're so sure of that, that's just great. You're really going very well. I'm even surprised. You're much stronger than I thought. That's what I was telling you about. JJ and I are the strongest and most powerful on the moon. No one wants to fight or quarrel with us. I want to test your strength, Mikey. If you can defeat my robots, then you will truly prove that you are the strongest of all. It will be really very easy. I'll just destroy all your robots and prove that I'm incredibly tough. No one will be able to stop me. The further you go, the more challenges you'll have. You'll have to think about every step of the way. After all, one mistake can cost you a lot. I understand all that very well. That's why I don't run very fast. I'm running steady and steady. I want to get there as fast as possible. I have water balloons and I can turn lava into obsidian. That's how I'm going to get farther. You can't confuse me. I really thought it would be very difficult for you. But I was wrong. These are really easy challenges for you. But let's see what happens next. I'm not afraid of your trials. I can pass them all and prove to you and JJ that I'm independent. That's the most important thing to me. I believe that you can be independent. These are really very difficult trials that you are going through. But it's going to get harder from here on out. Get ready for that, Mikey. I've already passed two of your tests. 
That means I can pass the others too. I can become a scientist in this lab. It will be really cool if you become a scientist. But you have to prove yourself to do that. The next test will be very special for you. You'll have to choose the right path among several blocks and go inside. I really hope there won't be any traps in there. Because if there are, I will destroy you. I just don't want to fall into the lava. Of course there will be traps. But the most important thing is that you have to guess the side. If you can, you'll pass this test. Scientist, don't even think about playing with me. If you can't show me something interesting, I'll destroy you. I want to be part of something incredible. If you stop me, it will be very, very bad. So it's in your best interest to help me. Mikey, this is a challenge. I can't help you. But I believe you can pass. You've gone too far. No one's ever gone this far, you know? You realize it's all about you and your skills. I won't stop you from going any further. Just do your best, okay? Okay, I'll do my best to pass these tests. But if I don't like something, I'll get even angrier. You know me. I know you, Mikey. And I believe that you have the power to change not only our world, but to prove your usefulness to JJ. I'm sure he'll regret throwing you off the moon. It really was a hasty decision and I think he made a mistake. That's right. I'm far more useful than all the possible scientists on his station. That's why I can't be replaced. I really hope you will be as effective in our science center. How did you like our test? Pretty tough, wouldn't you say? Yes, it's really very, very hard to guess. I make mistakes, but I still get through. It's really a great success. I hope you can cope with all the problems. You just need a little help with that. I hope you have enough strength. I'm 100% strong enough for anything I just want to do. It will be really, really cool if I can get through everything and prove myself. I'll be very happy if you can do it. The whole big problem is that you have to try to realize everything by yourself. I can only help you to find the right way. But remember, my robots are much stronger than you think. Make a small mistake and they will destroy you. It's very simple, Mikey. I specially tuned them so they won't let you rest and make a mistake. If you do, it will be dangerous for you. Yes, that's exactly what I needed. I really hope that your robots are at least a little stronger than you say they are. Because if I destroy them very, very quickly, it won't be any fun at all. I need real enemies. Who will try to destroy me and compete with me? Okay, if that's what you really want, I'll do my best to limit that. Wow, you really did it. You were able to defeat all of my robots and prove that you're worthy of joining us. That's just incredibly cool. It couldn't have been any other way. I told you from the beginning that I'm much stronger than all your robots and machines. So, what do we do next? How do I get started? I want to start learning something and being useful to this planet. You need to come with me and of course I will give you everything you need. Because you've shown yourself to be even better than I thought you would be. Just so I can make you a scientist, you'll have to surrender all your weapons and armor. Then, you can really become part of my team. Okay, no problem. I'm already used to not being trusted. That's why, I'll give you everything, and of course, I'll work with you. There's no problem with that. I'll explore space with you. Maybe even contact JJ one day and I'll tell him everything. Yes, we'll definitely do all that. You can move on. I'll tell you what needs to be done. Just make sure you don't ask too many questions. Okay, no problem. I can safely say that I'm very interested in your place. You are such a good and intelligent scientist. What's next for you? Come into the red square. Ha ha ha, you did it. Now, you're in my custody. You can't escape from here. Oh no friends, I'm trapped. We need to call JJ to rescue me now. Friends, I've received a danger signal. That means Mikey's trapped and I need to rescue him. He's only pressed that button twice in his life. So it seems to me that the situation is critical. I need to save him as soon as possible. You must be JJ. I've taken Mikey and I'm going to do experiments on him. He really is incredibly valuable to me. You can't take him away. What? I want Mikey back now. Or I'll destroy this place and you'll never be able to study anything again. I'm not giving you Mikey. 
He will serve our planet very well indeed. He could save a lot of lives. You're not going to give it back? Then I'll take it by force. Take it. It will truly be my best salvation. You won't be able to stop me. You who I did it. That means Mikey's out there somewhere. We need to destroy literally everything and get him out as fast as possible. JJ, I'm here. Please help me. There's a lot of turrets out here ready to destroy us. Be careful. I'll get Mikey organized. I'll save you. It's only a matter of time. It's going to be really, really good. Don't worry. It's so good to see you. Save me as soon as possible and let's go home from here. I want to go back to the moon because it's been horrible here. Mikey, run as fast as you can. I want to finish this whole adventure as fast as possible. Let's go back home. Let's celebrate and relax. I'm really glad it's over, that I can finally go home and have a good rest. So we will say goodbye to our friends. Friends, we will see you very soon. Bye everyone and take care.